Hey guys, this is Claude Pilon, Affiliate Starting Line. I'm having problems here with my Mac. As you can see here, I don't have any icons on my desktop. And uh, I had a, an application called Presenter Mate that used to uh, control whether I could turn them on or turn them off. Well, it turned them off, but it won't turn them on. So I'm going to have to um, use, first of all, I got rid of Presenter Mate, and now I'm going to um, use Time Machine, come back and get rid of, uh, get back into a, a a mode where everything was running properly. So how do you do that? Well, I'm going to do this. I am going to restart my machine. So I'm going to go up here, click Restart. Let's, and I'm going to say yes. It's black. Hi, folks. As soon as it restarts and goes to gray, I'm going to go down here and do Command R. Command R. We're doing this in real time, folks, so you'll have to bear with me. Now what this should do is bring me to a safe mode screen which will give me options to do a clean reinstall of the operating system or go to Time Machine and do an install from my backups on Time Machine. Now, I did this once before a couple days ago when this app uh, did the same thing and I very um, stupidly didn't get rid of the app so and I messed with it again today so this is how you fix this and that's how you go into time machine and uh, get your machine up and running again so I'm still waiting to see waiting for this dialogue command R this dialogue to come come back up Still waiting. Okay, I'm going to put it on uh, pause, and then when I get the dialog box, I'll show it to you. Okay, so now I've got um, my options here, and you can see I can go to Disk Utility, Get Help Online, I can reinstall the operating system. I'm going from the bottom up, and then at the very top, I can restore from Time Machine. So I'm going to come over here and restore from Time Machine. Now it says restore from Time Machine. To restore computer Time Machine, continue. So I'm going to come down here and hit continue. It's going to show me the drive where I have been storing my backups. I'll select it, and click continue. Go back. Okay, so now it's giving me dates and times of where I want to go back to. So I think I'm going to, today is the 10th, I'm going to go back to yesterday. And uh, everything was working fine, so I'm going to select this. I'm going to hit continue. Select the disk to which you want to restore. That's my Macintosh SD. I want to restore. So I selected the, the disk I want to restore. I'm going to click restore. I'm going to click, and then it's going to ask uh, restoring your erases all the blah blah. We already know that. I'm going to click continue. And now it's going to start restoring. So I'm going to reinstall my operating system and everything that was on the machine back to where everything was yesterday. Now you're going to see here it says restoring files. Gives me a percentage. It's calculating the amount of time. And uh, 
it's probably going to take, considering how much uh, stuff I have, more than an hour. So basically now it's I've begun a restore. That's how you use Time Machine. And I'll come back and show you what the results are. So I'm going to hit pause and we'll be back. So here we are. Uh, the restore took uh, an hour and 45 minutes. And uh, at the end of it, I got a gray screen that said that it was successful. When I clicked it, it took me to a screen that wanted me to re-register my Mac, just like it was the same procedure you, uh, you go through when you buy a new uh, computer. And uh, so I, I did it through my Apple account. And then it took me to my uh, login screen. And then from the login, I went from there and right up to my desktop here. And everything is the way it's supposed to be. And that's it. So that's how you store from Time Machine. Hope this has been helpful. This is Claude Blanc Affiliate starting on. Stay with it. Stay well. Talk soon.